Hi, my name is Jacob Wolfram and I'm the study advisor for the Master of Environmental Pollution Management, or short, ecotoxicology, here at the University of Landau. In this video, I want to give you an overview about our study program. Let's start with some basic information about our program. First of all, we always start in the winter semester, so that is in mid-October. We do not charge a tuition fee, so that is free for you. The application deadlines for non-EU citizens are June 15th and for EU citizens it's July 15th. All applications are handled by UniAssist. UniAssist is an external service provider that gathers, checks and validates all your supplied materials and then forwards them to us. Teaching takes place in presence and we always aim for a face-to-face -face format. That means we want to achieve a maximum of 30 students each year. This enables us to get to know you better individually and also to improve our curriculum so that's more personalized for you. The location is Landau in der Pfalz and the grades required are a minimum on a 3 out of 4 CGPA scale for natural sciences. On the German scale it's a minimum of 2.5 However, please be aware, on the German scale, one is the best obtainable grade. About Landau. Landau is a student city with approximately 50,000 residents. We currently have between seven and 8,000 students. So as you can see, it is a city bustling with students. Also, the Palatinate Forest is right at our doorstep. The Palatinate Forest is the largest continuous block forest in Central Europe. So you can go for activities such as hiking, biking, climbing and sightseeing and generally enjoy nature right outside our city. The university has currently approximately 8,000 students and 70% of which identify as female. We have at least five bachelor's and master courses in the environmental sciences currently, which means that you have a large student body with which you can interact with and talk about environmental issues or environmental topics in general. As such, in our faculties, we have 13 departments in the environmental sciences. These are departments that specialize in specific aspects of environmental sciences, such as environmental economics, landscape ecology, soil chemistry, or us in the ecotoxicology department. It's also very important for you so that you have a broader scope about environmental issues in general and also can inter... Next up, I want to bring your attention to the Welcome Center. The Welcome Center is a very special office in our university because it's there to help new students. It helps you prior to your studies, for instance, with your application, it assists you with your visa application, it organizes onboarding activities, it helps you to find a place to live in advance, it helps you and supports you with getting everything in order regarding your insurances, it organizes buddy programs so that you have a person for the first few months that you can directly talk to and that is more familiar with everything in and around Landau. They organize German language courses so that you can learn German for free and they organize exchange programs and lots of other activities. For instance, here on the right hand side, you can see there was a hike to the Trifels Castle just recently, where students participated and generally enjoyed the hike to this very old castle. If you want to get in touch with them, you can reach them under international at uni-landau.de. But what's ecotoxicology, you might ask yourself? Well. Ecotoxicology aims at identifying and quantifying the effects of chemical stressors on environments. And then in a second step, we always want to develop solutions or management strategies in order to reduce these adverse ecological effects. So there's an identification phase of problems and there is a solution phase for problems. And if you want to learn more, there are two additional videos that go more into detail what ecotoxicology generally is and also which programs we currently have so that you can see how ecotoxicology is practiced here in Landau. And next up, you may ask yourself, why should I study ecotoxicology? And there is one very clear reason and that is the chemization of environments keeps increasing. We are continuously 
producing more, synthesizing, trading, applying and circulating chemicals, some of which end up in the environment where they can cause harm. And this is not only a, an issue of the past or of the present, but as you can see here, it is an increasing issue globally. And so, especially in the future, we will require lots of well-developed and well-educated ecotoxicologists. And so in Landau, we teach ecotoxicology in various ways. You can participate in small-scale experiments, as you can see them here. But they go up in scale, for instance, here with landscape level um, observations or when we analyze whole ecosystems or whole landscapes. But it also means that you will be more familiar with chemical uh, techniques in the laboratory, that you learn more about rules and regulations to apply to chemicals or other stressors, that you have to participate in public discourse and that you have to learn how to analyze complex data because ecotoxicology is a very complex field. And for instance, up here you can also see how we analyzed the water quality for the entirety of Europe for the last 25 years. That is also a part of ecotoxicology. But ecotoxicology is also about studying and studying is an important part of your life. So you can participate in exchange programs or attend our summer school, for instance. The master in Landau is an international master, which means each year students from all over the globe come here to Landau in order to study ecotoxicology. We integrate you directly into our research right in the second week of the first winter semester so that you can choose from multiple projects and then be integrated in one of our working groups. You are able to personalize your studies with optional modules so you can choose something that you want to learn more about or maybe you want to broaden your horizon and learn something completely new. There's an internship that you have to take for at least eight weeks and this is always a great opportunity to already get in contact with future employers and also get a better understanding of the future work that may be waiting for you. Many students use this as a networking opportunity and meet their future employers already during their internship, massively improving their chances of finding a job. And finally, if you finished our program here, you already meet all the requirements in order to become a CTEC certified risk assessor. All you have to do is one final test at CTEC and then you obtain the certificate as well. Next, I want to briefly talk about the structure of our study. In the first semester, you will learn about various aspects of ecotoxicology, such as environmental analysis, the principles of ecotoxicology, or how to handle complex data. Then in the second semester, you will take part in the internship, learn more about the methods of ecotoxicology, but also molecular ecology. In the third semester, we bring most of the knowledge together so that you can apply them in models of ecotoxicology, so that is simulating responses, but also in risk assessment and management, where you then be able to fully assess the risk of various chemicals. It's also the research project course, which is a special project course because this will be the first time that you fully organize and conduct a 10 week program on your own and then write a final report on it. This also prepares you well for the master thesis so that you learn all the basics of good academic writing. And finally, in the fourth semester, there's then the master thesis. Many of our lectures also feature international guest lectures so that they can provide you with a specific point of view of their experience in the field. Regarding employment, the field of ecotoxicology is quite diverse and as such are also the opportunities for employment. First of all, there are large chemical industries who always need well-trained ecotoxicologists. There are also local up to federal agencies that are looking for ecotoxicologists currently. You can stay in research and continue your academic career. You can work for consultancies and planning bureaus in order to assess the risk of chemicals, for instance, or you can work for NGOs given the steady increase of decamization of environments. Here are some testimonials of our former students. For instance, Simon Lüderwald is currently a team leader at BISF, a very large or one of the largest international chemical firms. 
Verena Sesin is currently working for the Canadian Ministry of Nuclear Safety. Afolarin Ogumbemi is working for a renowned institute here in Germany, the Helmholtz Center. And Rebecca Bunchu is working for the Society of Environmental Toxicology and Chemistry in Europe. Now, if you decide to stay and research further, so continue your academic career, then we can provide you with a great outlook when it comes to research perspective. If you are familiar with publishing, then you may know some of these journals, most of which are very high ranking. And that is something that we want to continue to do so in the future as well. And if you like, then you can be part of that as well. Also, I want to bring your attention to the Graduate College System Link. A graduate college is a long-term research project where at least 36 PhD candidates and associated PhDs contribute to. It receives multidisciplinary supervision by professors, their additional technicians, staff, research assistants and many, many students involved in order to accomplish this 9 to 12 years of research project. It is funded by the DFG and it investigates the interactions of terrestrial and aquatic systems that are under anthropogenic stress. And as you can imagine, especially this interaction of stressors with terrestrial and aquatic systems is at the heart of ecotoxicology. So there is lots for you to do in the system link group if you want. Also our research facilities I want to briefly go over. Just recently we received a new laboratory building so we have a lot more new space for experiments here at the University of Landau. We have climate chambers for highly controlled small scale experiments. We have a stream microcosm where you can simulate a stream in a simplified manner. We offer a stream mesocosm facility, something that's very special to Germany here, as you can simulate more complex communities in a stream system with replicates in an ecotoxicological setup. The Eusertal Ecosystem Research Station is something that's very dear to our heart. It's in the Eusertal in the Palatinate Forest and it features many large basins in which you can conduct very complex aquatic terrestrial ecotoxicity tests. For instance here you can see how Verena Gerstle conducted some BTI experiments. And just recently the Riparian Stream Mesocosm Facility or short RSM was conducted and is currently in its finalization stage. This is a unique research facility to Germany because here it allows to simulate a small stream. You can induce flooding and most importantly, it's not only a stream mesocosm, but it also provides outside areas so that you can investigate the linkages of terrestrial and aquatic ecosystems. And in the future it will be used extensively and if you decide to study here then you can as work here as well if you're interested. And there are more facilities, field experiments, computer lab exercises and so on. I don't want to go into detail in the, those but you will get to know them once you arrive here. And that brings me more or less to the end. If you want to find additional information about our program, feel free to visit our homepage master-ecotoxicology.de. You can also visit our blog, the Ecotox blog. It has been active for several years now. It provides regular updates on extracurricular activities, new research proposals, new publications, conferences, anything that relates to ecotoxicology here in Landau is kind of archived in our blog. So if you want to get a quick idea about ecotoxicology here, please visit our blog. And there's our YouTube channel called Master Ecotoxicology. Here you find additional information and videos about our program. If anything is unclear, you can always ask me, just write me an email or call me. And finally, there's also a LinkedIn alumni. However, that is only for current and former students. So if you want to take advantage of that network, then you will have to study here. The alumni is so that our current and former students can network, they can share job opportunities, and generally you have the ability to see where people ended up in the end. And that, of course, greatly improves your job prospects. With that being said, I thank you very much for your attention and hopefully we see each other soon in person here in Landau.